So this is for Jeremy. Um, f of x equals minus 3 sine 2x plus 1. Label turning points plus end point. X intercepts not required. So you have to sketch it from sketch from 0 to 2 pi. So how do we do this question? Well, important elements that we need are the period, which equals 2 pi on n, n being the number in front of x. Here it's 2. So the period is pi. What's the starting point? Well, the starting point is, we said um, x is when, when x is 0. So we get sine of 0, which becomes 0. So starting point equals 1. And the amplitude is the number in front of sine, which is 3. OK? So now we can draw it. So pi, 2 pi. So we know it starts at 1. We know by the time it reaches pi, it should have completed one period. So there'd be two periods by here. We know the amplitude is 3, so the max height will be 4, and the minimum will be minus 2, because 1 plus 3 and 1 minus 3. And last thing is we need to look at this, and we notice this is minus. So normally our sine graph looks something like this. That's a positive version. If we make it free sine x, it should just get 3 times bigger, but it looks essentially the same and we can move it up by one. The minus is going to flip everything. Flip your mind. Um, so, how do we do this? We just do it upside down. Put it ending over here. Easy. Now it says label all the turning points and endpoints. So, the endpoint, we know it's two periods. We could probably figure out what the endpoint is as well. And we do that by subbing in 2 pi into that. So we get 3 sine 2 pi as x makes 4 pi. 4 pi plus 1. And looking at my circle, sine of 4 pi is so round once gives me 2 pi. Round twice gives me 4 pi. And the height is 0. Or we could say it's just two periods. So it's going to end where it starts. And now all the turning points. So here's the thing. We know this is pi, and this one will be pi on 2, because it's halfway between, you know, it's symmetrical. So this would be pi on 4, 3 pi on 4, or even looks symmetrical. It looks like that'd be the right answer. If you want to find a proof, let's say minus 2 equals minus 3 sine 2x plus 1. Okay? So we're trying to find this point because this is when y equals minus 2. So I'm setting that as y equals minus 2. Then minus 3 equals minus 3 sine 2x for 2x sine 2x equals 1. We get a height of 1 when the angle is pi on 2. So we put pi on 2 into sine, that gives us 1. Therefore, 2x equals pi on 2 or x equals pi and 4. So there's a quick proof, but you don't need that. Anyway, this becomes pi and 4, 3 pi and 4, 5 pi and 4, 7 pi and 4. And let's put 4, 4, minus 2, minus 2. There's our graph. Cheers.